Hey guys, this is Eskimo Poodle, and we are back with Let's Play Batman Arkham Asylum on the Xbox 360. Last time, we tracked Dr. Young's fingerprints into this room right here, and then we had to save those two bozos from a uh, trap of Joker's gas that turned out to not be all that gassy, so do not open before April 1st. Oh, I never even noticed that. That's a joking little bastard. But yeah, um... Turns out there was no gas in there, but looks like he might have released some over here. Cause you see that looks kind of looks kind of gassy to me. But hopefully it doesn't hopefully it doesn't hurt us too bad. But anyways, cause now we gotta go. Uh, now our new objective is to track down um, Doctor Young, who's being held hostage by Mister Zaz in the warden's office. So we gotta do that. Oh, and by the way, if my um, if my uh, upgrades in this video that I have um, differ from what I have in a upcoming video, either 11 or 12 episode, I'm not sure, um, that's because I had to re-record this part because, for some reason, it decided to randomly corrupt the video file that I had. So when I went to go, uh, when I went to go merge the video with the audio, I had to realize, hey, you got to re-record this, fucker. I'm like, okay, fuck you too. I don't like you, but oh well, you gotta do what you gotta do. Anyways, let's go ahead and let's go ahead and go find Dr. Young and hopefully that gas isn't gonna do too much. But Batsy Boy should have a antidote, right? Alright, let's see if I can't uh, let's see. Okay. That didn't work out too well. I was gonna like ninja roll through it and hope that it didn't affect me, but I guess it does. Let's make sure I, there's no uh Okay, my eyes are okay, so I don't think it's affecting me or anything. Wayne What do you mean Wayne Manor? We're not in Wayne Manor. Alright, don't tell me it did affect me. I just can't tell because my eyes are aren't as glowy as they're supposed to. How the heck are we in Wayne Manor? This is still obviously Arkham Mansion. And this hallway seems a bit longer than what it was. And it's uh, raining. That's kinda odd, but okay, I guess. And I can't seem to attack or dash or detect a mode or anything. That's kind of odd, actually. I can't believe you insisted on sitting through that movie again, Bruce. He likes movies. Come on, we'll be late for Alfred. I'm sorry, Daddy. Go easy on the Tom. He loved it so. Alfred will wait. Keep up, Bruce. Well, yeah, as a butler, that's kind of his job to wait for you, right? I wonder how old Alfred is, actually. Where are you taking us? We can cut through here. But it's starting to rain. Bruce is tired. Can't we just wait for him here? Come on, keep up. We're nearly there. Why is it all dark back there? There were lights a few minutes ago. So it looks like we're in an alleyway. Kinda. An alleyway with ceiling fans. And sacks of newspaper that... Hey, you can zoom, but you can't do anything else. I wonder if they say anything. Can I read them? Okay, they say something, but I can't read them, so whatever. And am I going the right way? Oh, Please, there's no need for this. Stay where you are. I'll shoot. I'll give you whatever you want. Tom! Oh God! Oh God, Tom! Be quiet, lady. Just shut up. Stay away from me! Run! Mommy! Oh, this is the night that Bruce's parents were killed. Okay. Maybe that gas we inhaled is causing us to hallucinate. Come on, kid, this way. Take a seat in my office. And now this we're okay. young Bruce. He'll be fine. Kid like that with all that money, he'll be just 
Oh yeah, money solves all the problems. Shut up, now. He's eight years old and all alone. Money will fix that. Whatever you say, Gordon. His butler's on his way to pick him up. You hear that? He's got a butler. You're just jealous because you don't got a butler. I'm sorry about that. I just need to ask you some questions. Can I get you anything? Can you walk a little slower, kid? Please? A little slower. I know you don't feel like answering me, but it's the only way to catch who did this. I don't know. It's this city. There's something wrong with it. And listen, son. Call me Jim. Okay, that was a, an annoying sequence. Or not, not really annoying, just annoying. I've always wondered, would Bat, would, would uh, Bruce Wayne still have become Batman if his parents weren't brutally murdered in front of him? I mean, like, would he still just be like, hey, Gotham's fucked up and I need to try to clean it up or something, or would he just just be living, living the rich millionaire playboy life still? And... This looks... This looks very familiar to the Scarecrow section from earlier in the game. Don't tell me we gotta redo another Scarecrow section. Ah, son of a bitch. God damn it. What are you trying to do? Okay, yep, it's Scarecrow. Okay, that explains it. So the Scarecrow Venom made him relive uh, his parents being murdered. Okay, I see, I see, I got gotcha. you. Can't see me. Ah, son of a bitch. Oh, there you I actually died a lot the first recording of this. I died like six times. So I'm gonna try to not die like six times this time. Hopefully that one will be the only one. Alright, let's try to make this in a one shot here. Son of a bitch! Okay, fine. Two shots. Three shots. Okay, we're on try three, so this would be three shots. Okay, got it. I'm not gonna die again. I'm... And if I do die, then too bad, so sad. Okay, so I thought I had enough time to dash in there between uh, his little search, but obviously not. And I'm such a dumbass. It took me way too many tries to figure out that you have to. Uh, pull these down for cover. I kept trying to think I could uh, run past them. You'd think you would see them falling down like that. I mean like, hey they were up there now they're not. I'm waiting for one thing. I want to see something real quick. Because when that light bulb flickered or whatever, it looked like a uh, looked like Batman's costume changed for a second. Oh, I might have just been a bat. Yeah, see, it looks like it's changing, but I can't tell. Can't tell if it is or not. Trying to escape you, fucker. I don't like being in hallucinations. Ah, fun of a son of a bitch. Those guys are a little tougher than you'd think they were, because uh they're actually they're actually kinda of fast. They attack they attack pretty fast and I died on them once or twice on my other run. Okay, wait for you to turn around and I shall go. Come on. Come on, you ugly bastard. Honestly, I don't remember if there are any more scarecrow parts after this. I really don't. 
this could be the last one, or there could be another one. I don't remember. I honestly thought that the uh, first one was the uh, only one we had to do, but obviously I was wrong. Oh, come on, Bats. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. There we go. Come on. Turn around, you bastard. <laughs> I thought Batman developed a, uh, an antidote that, like, prevented the, uh, toxin from working on it. Like, at all. I thought he had, like, a booster shot against it or something. I think if you go in the light when fighting those guys, it still counts as a, uh, MC in you, so try to avoid it. Actually, I'm doing much better now than I was on my previous run. So like I said, I did die like five or six times. But that was just from mainly getting caught looking. I only died on the skeletons like once, I think. But he kept seeing me when I was trying to like go around corners and crap. And I was not being very uh, stealthy. Up. Oh. Yeah, see? He just turned into like a, a miniature version of the Scarecrow right there. I think. That's, I never noticed that before. Ah, I crouched, you son of a bitch! I crouched. Gee, you think? That's what I'm trying to do, but you know, kind of doesn't work with the crouching doesn't, but it doesn't work, bastard. All right, let's try this again. And I wasn't paying attention one of the times, and I did die right into that pendulum, and uh, kind of died. Alright, we are close to the end. There is our spotlight of hope. And I almost got caught right there. Almost. Aha. I know I can do it. There's no escape. And I probably had plenty of time up there, didn't I? I wasn't sure if I did, so I decided to play it safe. Okay, as soon as you turn around, I should get you. Yes. Alright, we are done. There you are. I still don't get it. Is he allergic to light or what? Why would the, uh... Why would the light beat him? And somehow we got into the clock tower. Where's the cape? Jumps out of the shadows and sees up useless thoughts. <laughs> Good. Zaz has Dr. Young trapped in the warden's office. I've got to get out of here. I'm going. How the heck did you get from Okay, I know where we're supposed to go. But how the heck did we get from down here, which was on like Wait, it was right here, I think, actually. How the heck do we get from there all the way up in, like, three stories up a freaking, uh, freaking, like, a uh, bell tower, clock tower thing? How the heck do we get all the way up here? Okay, I don't think there's anything up there we can do, but obviously the thing we gotta do is we got this two. Well, gotta aim our batarang and cut this steel cable, which is you don't think would be able to be cut by a tiny little battering type thing, but oh well. Yeah. 
I haven't played the second game, so I'm wondering, does uh, Bruce offer to pay for all the damages to the uh, to the asylum that he incurs? I mean, sure, obviously they're not going to realize, hey, uh, Bruce Wayne is Batman, and he got us to pay for the damages, but do you think uh, Bruce will be nice and just uh, pay for the, the damages anyways? Its reputation was in tatters, but I vowed to fix it. As the buildings were rebuilt, I saw the future. A bright, wonderful future. Okay, that was like the shortest Arkham... Uh, whatever the fuck his thing is. Armadius Arkham. That was like the shortest frickin' one ever. It's like two seconds. Okay, um, let's see, where do we gotta go again? Ah, we gotta go this way, I think. Yes, indeedy. And we still can't get through there yet. And that's why I'm saving a couple upgrades. Is for something we're gonna be getting soon. Um, like I said, if I have a different amount of upgrades in this episode, or the next couple episodes, um, it's just because, uh... You try and get past me, Bats, and I will fry you! I had to redo this part, that's all. These guys, they have stun sticks, or... something. You could either... You could either, uh... bat cape them, which doesn't work all that well, or... you could dash over them like that. Which works a lot better. Hi! I've been waiting for you, listening to Zaz make the good doctor scream while you played around in Scarecrow's world. Hey, Scarecrow is a fun guy to hang around with. Learn sometimes. Learn about yourself? Oh, tell me. Pull up a seat. Talk to me. I'm all ears. I thought there was a grate around here I could climb, but oh well. Wait, what? One unarmed? Certainly sounded like it. <laughs> Stay where you are, Batman. Oh, him. listen to me carefully. Help me! Please, somebody help me! Technically, he's armed I'm with a knife, but oh well. Don't paint the room crimson with her blood. <laughs> I know. Still out there. Won't be long and you'll hear her final song. Now here's something we don't do often enough is the uh, corner cover. But if I kill her, the bat will get me. No, you're not scared of a little bat, are you, Slicey? I'm a scary guy. Gotcha. And so she attacks him. You evil, evil, evil monster! <laughs> He's not going anywhere. You can stop now. Sorry. I'm so sorry. Didn't we I capture him at the beginning baby. of the game, though? I know. I, I, Joker threatened me. I wanted to stop the experiment. I tried to give him his money back. Joker doesn't take no for an answer. He wants an army, a horrible twisted force to destroy Gotham, but he couldn't do it without the formula. I hit it, but... So now he has Venom and your formula. God, he has gallons of the stuff. There's a lab, hidden in the gardens. It's locked off, but the security key codes for the entire island are in the warden's safe. What else is Joker planning? How should I know? You think anything he says makes sense? I think he's insane. <laughs> oh my god! Get out of the way! <laughs> Ouch. That's gotta hurt. Young. Still, you know how Mr. J hates a squealer. Mm. Mm. Talking about squealers. Oh. Ow. Oh, somebody help me. Ah. That's gotta hurt. That old loony actually thinks he runs this place. Talk about crazy. Well, bad places to go. Get him, boys. If he gets up, knock him down, but not too rough. Mr. J needs him at the party. What party? That's gotta hurt though, I mean, I mean, she hit him hard enough to... 
she hit him hard enough for the scepter to break in half. I mean, I'd assume a scepter is a pretty durable type of staff, but. Ow, son of a bitch. Alright. The guy with the stun stick is out, and so is everyone else. Oracle, Dr. Young is dead. Have you figured out a way past these security gates? Before she died, she told me there's a production plant hidden somewhere in the gardens. The Wayne Tech security protocols seem to be hack-proof. Lucia just did a good job. It's a two-part biometric sequence, apparently generated by the Warden, using a code sequencer. And destroyed by Joker in the safe explosion. Harley Quinn has the Warden, and he's the only chance we have to get past these gates. Okay. Good luck. Okay, before I do that though, it took me a while to figure out or actually I'll think it of something else, never mind. Forget forget what I was about to say. But we gotta scan this guy for a Joker riddle. Or riddle whatever. Who cares? You know what I mean, right guys? Okay, and let's see, I'm not sure if there's anything else to uh find in here. Will you Where am I? Where am I? Okay, there's I don't think there's really anything else in here that we can that we can find. I'm not sure, but I think uh Dr. Young is actually voiced by the uh is actually voiced by the person that uh the girl that did number two on codename kid codename Kids Next Door. It sounds like her at least. But I just I just think it's her. It might not be, but it certainly sounds a lot like her. And apparently we can't get up there. Well, screw you too. Anyways, the thing that we gotta scan is the thing that broke off and... Is it covered in blood or what is it? Yep, it's covered in blood. Thought it might have been like a, his saliva or something, but... Saliva, not saliva. But yeah. She hit him hard enough to... Draw blood and break the scepter in half. That's a pretty damn hard hit. So we got tobacco, vapor, evidence, footprint, fingerprint, DNA. That's a lot of damn tracking in that little, uh, that little cowl of his. Alright, now we gotta find Mr. Warden Quincy Sharp, who is... out here somewhere. Where is he? And there's another unarmed bozo for us to take care of, wherever he's at. Did I get all three of them yet? One, two, yep. Wait. Okay, I think I did. Eh, yeah, close enough, whatever. Ooh, they're armed. That's not good. Ah, there they are. She likes older guys. Now, you heard that, right? Yeah, yeah, you know where to find me later. Okay. I need to get behind these guys. So... Ah, there he is. Okay, seriously, I'm directly in that guy's line of vision right there. How does he not see his... Okay, I, I guess he did see me. I was gonna say, how the heck does he not see me, but... Apparently he did. Son of a bitch. Okay, I'm gonna try that again and this time not fail miserably. You know, because that would be awesome. Alright, let's try that again, shall we? By the way, uh, something I forgot to mention is uh, one of the upgrades you get after figuring out they're wearing those collars that that they tell you about where the, that'll let the Joker know if they're uh, 
knocked out or whatever, is we have a uh, upgrade called the Sonic Battering right here, which you can use to distract uh, the guys wearing the collars. It'll kind of like uh, draw them away from the crowd or whatever. I don't really bother you with it, so if you want to use it, yeah, I guess it could be useful, but I'm more of a straight up uh, approach type of guy, so I just don't bother with it. Okay, let's see. Okay. Shut it now. You heard that, right? Yeah, yeah. You know where to find me later. Idiot. All right, get you. Okay, that guy is not looking at us again. So. Ah, damn it. Oh, there's only three. You heard Joker. Joker was right. I found someone. Well, good for you. Okay, how am I gonna get to these guys? Wake up, you hear me? Wake up! Anyone? It's the bat! Damn it! I was trying to go for a silent takedown, but it didn't work. Son of a bitch! Okay, let's try this again. Hey, oh, hush. someone held Bat Baby up off the floor. Bat Baby? He sees me. Go, go, go. Get back, back, back. Move, you bat bastard. Damn it. Come on. Go somewhere. There we go. Alright. I didn't have anywhere near as amount of trouble when I did it the first time, actually. I don't remember how I did it, though, but I remember I managed to get all three on a, uh, on silent takedowns. Down. Okay, can they see me? No? Okay, I'm good still. Alright, as soon as you turn around, I can silence your silence your ass. Come on, turn around. No? There we go. Gotcha. Hey, that guy's like two feet away and he doesn't even notice. I was directly in front of him. He should have seen me right there. I don't know what the fuck happened right there, but... Oh well. Either way, we got it. Hey, seriously. I was, like, right there. He should have seen me. Anyways. Back to tracking this guy by his trail of blood. Which is always fun. Uh, let's see. Which way did the trail of blood go? There it is. Ah. Okay, this way. I thought it might have taken us outside the island, but I guess not. Or not the island, but the mansion. Okay. Okay, where is the blood? Okay. Wait, is this the way we just came from? Oh, I think this is the way we just came from, actually. Okay, yeah, I'm going the wrong way. Wait, what'd that say? Oh, a game of cat and mouse can be painful. I remember this one. There we go. Here it is. The, uh, goggles for Catwoman. 
Another one? Can it be? No, there's no way. You can't find them all. It's impossible. I like I like one where he can, he accuses you of cheating and using like a strategy guide or something. He's breaking the fourth wall. I don't I don't remember what he says it, but the first time I heard it, I just busted up laughing. Honestly, I like strategy guides. Like, I kind of collect them actually if I if I get a chance. Not not just for the fact that they're useful, because a lot of them are straight up not useful. They have wrong information. I just like them. I don't know. It gives me something to read on the toilet or something. I don't know. And I think I got you already. Okay, yeah. As soon as I find you. Let's see. Yeah, it's outside, okay. And now we just gotta figure out where he's where he went to. As of ten minutes ago, I have made it illegal to walk on the floor in any part of the asylum. Anyone caught doing so will be Oh, this is stupid. I can, ah, uh, uh, anyone caught will have their legs removed and perform magic tricks for Emperor Joker. Magic tricks? There, I did it. I, ah. You're doing great, Sharpie. Ready for more? And I see uh, Joker got a uh, promotion. He used to be the prince of crime. Now he's the... Uh, Emperor, apparently. Get up. There we go. Alright, there's thugs. Let's make some harmony with my, with my fists. Okay, you guys are armed. Hell yeah! Never liked her anyway. You're cold, man. Funny thing. Screw it here! Don't let him hit you, you idiot! That's kind of hard to do. Ow! This will hurt. You're dead, Batman! Jeez! Now that I'm trying to get those, uh... There we go. Special takedown. Very nice. I like it. Come on, get him. Ah, you bastard. Nice. Oh, and the kneecap. That's gotta hurt. Knee to the face. Okay, which way did I come from? I came from the east, so I think it ends up over here. Wait, no. Um, eh, it's around here somewhere. But I came from somewhere. Where the heck did I come from? Oh, I came from this direction. Okay. One armed, six unarmed. So we got a few more. This is the warden. It is my to everyone unarmed their side. What the heck? Yeah! What the heck was that? I recommend unloading them into... I can't read this. Yeah! Unloading them into your head. That'd make my job easier if you guys uh, shot yourselves. And go for the ledge takedown if I can. No? There we go. That's the one I like. And now, just for the heck of it, just because I can. Nice. And obviously, wherever the thugs are, that's uh, it's gonna kind of be the way we have to go to uh, find Mr. Warden. I'm just gonna go charging in here. Check my pulse now, Doc. Knock. It's the 
Punch him again! Punch him again, yes. That's really good advice, guys. Just keep punching him, it might work. Nice takedown again, very nice. Ow. This'll hurt. Come on, can I do it? Nice, flawless combat. 20 combo, very nice. Ah, I'm not usually very good at that, but when I am, it feels so good. Alright, you got anything useful to say, Pally? Anything at all? Orderly? Thank you, Batman. The guard wouldn't have lasted much longer. Is he okay? He struck his head when they knocked him to the ground. Move him away from here as soon as you can. Take him to the medical facility. It's the safest place on the island. Okay. I'll go with him as soon as he's able to stand. Alright. So, we gotta go in here. But first, let's, uh... Let's, uh, see what's in there. I do believe it's just a, uh... Wait. Is this the way in, or is this just a Riddler trophy? Okay, it's just a Riddler trophy. What do you call someone who has failed to solve three quarters of my riddles? A Batman? Okay, that was just lame. Anyways, here's where we gotta go. And, uh, video's getting kinda long, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna end it right here. And then next time, we will continue on through the, uh, wherever the heck we are. We'll continue on through the uh, penitentiary in our search for Warden, or not Warden, but, uh, wait, is it Warden? Eh, either way, we're looking for, uh, oh, he is the Warden, okay, so Warden Sharp, so, guys, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Have a good night.